inspired you for that shot we just did? The inspiration of that shot, you know, I really wanted to kind of focus on them together and kind of running away. And it is, I've seen the shot, I forgot what movie I've seen it in, but I always liked the idea of revealing revealing at the last minute and then the shot just kind of camera just kind of focuses on it um, and so you have this beautiful two shot of them running cameras in the middle their hands are center frame and then they're running together until the truck comes blocks them off and they split apart the camera comes in and you just see a clean of the truck and so it was three moving parts and the idea behind it was to pull them together as a unit escaping together and then just see how that kind of gets blown apart with the reveal of the truck in the end. So, um, I mean, that's pretty much it, man. I mean, it's it's one of my favorite shots. You know, it's a shot that's probably gonna stick around for the movie. Um, we just did 11 takes of it, um, in which like five of them were solid. And so then there's six that are like, meh. But uh, yeah, man, so that's pretty much it. What's it like to do this in the ground? Yes. Runaways? Yes. Well, so far, it's a lot of work. Uh, exhausting. I'm the only one running a camera. There's really no one helping me. And I'm just joking now. There's a huge crew. They're awesome. They're great. And uh, it's just fun. You know, it's, uh, it's the Runaways. Dewey is an awesome director. I've shot another film for him before and it turned out really great. And uh, yeah, it's just um, it's, uh, it's going to be a fun movie. How about operating the Ronin? The What's Ronin? that like? Uh, it's cooler than operating a stabilizer. I mean, you know, uh, what do you call it? Um, what do you call those again? Glider? Uh, no, yeah, glider and the other one. But I've stabilized, you know those giant stabilizers that hold? It's just yeah. much smaller, super simpler, and just more convenient for us to be shooting in locations like this where people aren't going to watch this sort of robot guy walking down the street. It's more like some guy with a little smaller camera. It's less, uh, it's more incognito mode. People draw less attention. And the last thing we want is drawing attention to ourselves because people want to come in, they want to be in the shot, they want to look around. And, and how does that piece of equipment play into that specific shot of the couple running running down the street. Oh, you really can't do it without it. I mean, it's just, uh, it's just impossible. It's just, okay, we gotta, I'm sorry. Yeah, it's just, you just can't do it without it. It's just, um, sorry, I'm just not gonna be good at interviews.